I'm Street Meteorologist Alex Iverson from the Penn State Campus Weather Service here with your CCR forecast. Our current cameras pointed out at Beaver Stadium. We can see patchy clouds currently affecting our area with our current temperature sitting at 46 degrees and that feels like 42 degrees with this west-northwest wind at 8 miles per hour. Looking across the central portion of Pennsylvania, we can clearly see that there is a front moving through the area with Clearfield at 45 degrees, State Hall to 46. However, looking to our south and our east just a little bit, we can see Harrisburg is currently at 57 degrees. We can really see this stark difference if we look across the whole state of Pennsylvania with Philadelphia sitting at 64 degrees, Allentown at 59, and then moving across over into Erie. They're at 43 degrees, and Bradford's not even making it up into the 40s they're currently at 39 degrees our radar and satellite again you can see that front moving through our area with those clear skies in the southeastern portion of the state with some cloud cover mainly spanning all the way from central county into the northwestern and into the northeastern portions of pennsylvania Looking at our future cast, we can see those clouds will begin to clear out of our area with clear skies spanning all the way across Pennsylvania. However, that will be changing if we move into the dinner time and nighttime hours of tonight. We can see those clouds will begin to build in the southwestern portions of the state, like the Pittsburgh metro and into the Johnstown area. And this will continue to span across most of the Bottom half of Pennsylvania into tomorrow morning. We can also see there are going to be some patchy showers throughout the day in the early hours on Thursday, affecting places like Pittsburgh, Johnstown, Altoona, and they may even creep their way into the center county borders. Uh, we'll see about that moving on. And again, those patchy showers will continue throughout the day on Thursday. Again, most of them are staying south of the center county border, but I could clearly and easily see them moving their way up into State College, so we may be seeing some chances of rain tomorrow. Now our big chance of rain and our definite chance of rain will be Thursday night into Friday morning. We can see around 7.30 a.m. all of Center County will be affected by some sort of rain in the morning, especially places like Pittsburgh and that Pittsburgh metro area. We'll be seeing some heavier rain to start off their day on Friday. Looking at our forecast for today, clouds will be decreasing, like I said, a clear sky is expected throughout all of Pennsylvania, with that high sitting at 65 degrees. Those winds will be wester westerly 10 to 15 miles per hour, but those gusts will be up to 20 miles per hour. So not only are our temperatures going to be cooler than they were yesterday, we're also going to have those wind gusts, which will make it feel even colder. However, that sun will be very nice today. Looking into tonight, 42 degrees as our low, partly cloudy skies. That wind will die down just a little bit and move to the northwestern direction, 5 to 10 miles per hour. And looking for tomorrow, again, like I said, maybe some light rain possible for Center County. That high will be 67 degrees tomorrow, and those winds will be south 5 to 10 miles per hour. Now, if we look at our seven-day forecast, it's pretty much the same story. Sun and clouds today, 65 degrees as our high. Moving to Thursday and Friday, we are expecting some chances of rain, especially on Friday. Rain will be on and off throughout the day. Those temperatures will also drop at the start of our weekend on Friday with 63 as our high and 59 as our high on Saturday. However, we will be expecting abundant sunshine throughout the day on Saturday. And then moving into Sunday and the start of next week and finals week for Penn State students, we should be expecting some rain uh, throughout the day on Sunday into Tuesday, which will be good because that might be some motivation to stay inside and study for those finals. From the Penn State Campus Weather Service, I'm Sue Meteorologist Alex Iverson. Have a great day.